Well, you're gaining a bit of a reputation at the moment as a, as a bit of a super sub. Is that a tag that uh, you're happy with? No. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, yeah, look, you, uh, when you're not playing games, all you can do is sort of come off the bench and sort of do what you can for the team. So, yeah, I'm sort of happy in a way that I've done that. But, of course, like any other player, I want to be starting games. And I think if I do start games and get a run, I'll be able to score even more goals. So... Um, we'll see what happens um, made a couple of sort of important goals the last sort of Wrexham and Geisley so hopefully I'm sort of making problems for the gaffer yeah and uh, and if there are changes Barry with it being a, a short turnaround you feel you've done enough to, to earn a start well yeah I hope so um, I think like I said, after the Wrexham game, didn't play against Eastley, um, didn't get much time on Halifax and obviously got a bit longer at Geisley and managed to get another goal. So it's all I can do really, just keep plugging away and um, when I'm on the pitch, sort of do my best. So I hope so, um, but obviously it's down to him. Yeah, obviously nice that you are able to come on though and, and make an impact in games, but it, how frustrating is it watching on from the sidelines? Yeah, it can be when, especially when um, sort of the game's not quite going our way. So obviously, sometimes the game is going our way, and I sort of sort of sit down and, and feel like well done, well done to the lads. Like the the, the, the gaffers picked that team for a reason, and they they're doing their job. Um, so it's hard for me to sort of say, well, I should be playing when we're winning, but. Um, that's just football sometimes you don't know how the game's going to play out so obviously you've just got to keep yourself ready yeah. um, but at the same time yeah you want to play games so. and how did it feel to, to get that late goal at, at Geisley yeah like, um, it's the best feeling in the world scoring goals so um, when I can do it I sort of do it basically um, I think it was more important than Obviously, Cheltenham drawing as well, so um, it was more important than I thought at the time. Yeah, and obviously you've been on this great run and you probably haven't been rewarded in terms of closing the gap on Cheltenham until um, Tuesday, so did, did you take sort of greater satisfaction from that? Yeah, definitely. Um, we have done very well recently and again, that's sort of one of the reasons why I'm still on the bench because the, t- the team have been fantastic, but... Um, keep winning, keep getting results and Cheltenham keep doing the same so um, it is very frustrating but we can only f- focus on ourselves and do what we can do and um, that's what we've been doing really but yeah, Tuesday night they only picked up a point so we sort of closed the gap Yeah, and it's now 10 games unbeaten 9 of those wins have, have you ever been involved in a run like this before? Um, not what I remember no, I don't think I have. So yeah, it is um it is very good to be part of to be fair. Yeah, I was gonna say what what is it like to, to be part of and the, the spirit must be amazing the change of room must be buzzing really. Yeah, exactly. Like the the team team are on a very good very very good run and um and they're on a high but um it is good it's good to be a part of that, like obviously I do wanna be playing sort of more football getting more time but when the team's doing that I can't really complain and I'm a team player I, I do what I have to do so 